Hi there and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Nyasha. Thank you so much for taking time to watch my video. And if you've been here before, thank you so much for coming back. I really, really appreciate you. So today, as you've seen from the title of the video, I'm going to be doing a review or rather a coverage test of the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Foundation. This one right here by Rihanna. Yeah, it's not a new foundation by any means. So I'm just going to be doing a coverage test of this foundation. Yes. Okay. Okay, so before I start, I'm just going to read what they say about this foundation. So they say uh, it's a soft matte long wear foundation. And uh, what else do they say? They say it's medium to full coverage for all, all skin types, I guess, is an oily combination, dry skin types, any skin type can use this foundation. Uh, it's long wear, they don't specify how long you can wear this foundation for, and it's as light as air. That's what they say about it. Okay, so the shade that I have that I was matched with in the store is 430. They took 430, they took 440, and they took 450. And they tried to match me to all of these different shades and I ended up matching with this particular one, which is 430. So without much ado, let's get straight into this. And also, hey, hey, <laughs> if you like me, please subscribe to my channel. I'd really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, let's do this. So I'm going to start by priming my face and I'm using the Fenty Beauty um, Mattifying Primer, this one here, that's the one that I'm going to be using. So I'm just going to shake it up a little bit, shake it up. And then I'm going to take a few pumps of it and then just apply, especially to the areas where I get oily fast. I'm going to start by taking two pumps of this foundation. So I'm just going to put them here. Okay, so I don't really like getting foundation on my fingers. Like, I just don't like it. So I'll just use my brush to apply the foundation all over my face. And if there's any need for me to put any more, I would do that as I go. But otherwise, to start, I'll just use my foundation brush to just make sure that I put everything all over my face. The brush that I'm using is the Morphe. Morphe brush, this one here. So I'm just gonna start blending. Okay, I know it might look a little too yellow, like what is going on, but let me just be quick to say this. It oxidizes, it does. So I know it's gonna be darker because when they tested me in the store, the 440 was a little too red for me. 450 was a little too dark for me 420 was definitely too light for me so this was the closest shade for me you see now all that yellowness is starting to die down hmm. So it looks like I might have to apply a bit more, especially around this area. So one thing I'm noticing though, when it comes to blending this foundation, you need to do it fast, quickly, because it dries really fast. So you need to make sure that, you know, you do it quickly. So I'm just gonna apply two more pumps, cause why not? <laughs> why not? Apply some here. I think just one more pump would be enough. Two more would be a bit too much. So you see, when you're first applying it, it looks so yellow, but then when it's drying, it settles into this color that is really, really close to my uh, skin tone. It's matching it, and it's not too red. As opposed to 440, 440 was like ooh, red, red, red throughout. I wouldn't have been able to wear it because it would just make my face stand out, stick out. Mm, I like the soft mat that, that they speak of. But I guess I'd also like to try the other formula as well. And also I like that it's not cakey. Yay. <laughs> we love a foundation that is not cakey here. We just love it. All right, so there we go. So what do you guys think of the coverage? I feel like um, it's really, really decent because 
I'm not seeing the dark marks right now. I'm not seeing them at all. I'm not, to be honest. If I say I'm seeing them, I'll, I'll be lying to you. So I'm not really seeing them at all. And I guess that's what we're looking for in a foundation. Mm, I like what I see. What do you guys think of this? Do you like the coverage? Do you like the foundation? Do you like the finish of this foundation? I think uh, it has got like a decent finish and it's not drying it doesn't feel like it's drying me at all i don't i don't feel like you know my skin is dry at all i don't know it doesn't look dry it doesn't i'm tempted not to set it but you know you still have to set it because if you don't set it at some point it's going to start creasing i have no idea if this is like a color stay foundation or not i have no idea but i know it says here that um it's uh, for long wear, so it doesn't specify for how long. It doesn't specify if it rubs off or not. I don't know if any of that happens, but I'm just gonna set it just to make sure that, you know, uh, I'm safe. So I'm gonna use my Laura Mercier translucent medium deep powder to just set all over my face, to just set the foundation to make sure that it stays in place before I continue with the rest of the makeup, so. I'm just gonna press the powder into my skin. Voila! <laughs> so now, what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna continue like with the rest of my makeup, just finish it off, and then I will see you on the other side, on the flip side. All right, so there you have it. Um, this is what the foundation looks like in the end. I really like it. I Definitely, I don't feel like I'm wearing anything, to be honest. I don't feel like I'm wearing any foundation at all. It just feels so lightweight. It doesn't feel like it's overwhelming my, my skin. Yes, it is a, like a, a soft matte finish, which I like. It's not dry. It's not super matte. It's not, I don't know, draining the, you know, the, the moisture of my skin. I don't feel that way at least. So I really like this foundation. As far as the coverage goes, like, look at that look at that i don't see like the marks that are that are like on my face the dark the the acne marks that i have on my face i don't see them so yeah that's it thank you so much for taking time to watch my video if you like me please subscribe to my channel and also if you like this video just give it a like feel free to share it with your friends with the people with your peeps but from me for now it's bye